What's going on everybody? It's your boy Killer B coming back at you. This is gonna be a short, sweet video. Hey, I just want to show you all something. If y'all caught my last video where I put the Trask power plate on the clutch right here, that is for you guys that are making big horsepower and you know the, the 200 horsepower, 150 horse, 150 torque, all the way up from there. And um you don't want your clutch slipping. But one thing that I noticed when I finished the video and I got on the bike to take the ride the bike out, I noticed my friction zone has changed. Like right here, when I pull the clutch in, I usually have to let my clutch way out here to feel it start catching. But now I barely let it out about right here. And I'm gonna show it to you. I'm gonna crank the bike up. I'm gonna let you see, see that and how the bike start trying to pull with me just barely letting this clutch out. So uh, we're going to fire the bike up, and I'm going to show you uh, how, how, how it's doing. So let's check this out. Hopefully my, my radio don't pick up everything. <laughs> so, so check this out right here. When I... See, it's all ready, ready to go. See that? It's ready to go. Look at that. I don't even have to let it out that far. Did y'all see how my bike was pulling? It's, it's ready to go right there. I used to have to let that baby way out here, but now it's just right off in here somewhere. So, man, that thing really works, y'all. So, check out Trask. Check out the power plate. This going to only run you like $149 for this. Now, if you go buy a brand new clutch, it's going to cost you pretty good. Like an Evolution clutch, you want to upgrade your clutch. That's a piece that just upgraded my stock clutch to a much better clutch that can handle 200 horse, 200 torque at the rear wheel. So, man, I will tell you like this. Check that out because it changed the friction zone and stuff on my clutch. Like I say, when I usually, I usually have to let it way out here. But now it's just right here. I can feel it start pulling right then and there. So, man, that is a lot better. Uh, my clutch don't feel that bad at all. It's, it's a little bit tighter, but it's not bad at all. It ain't where my hand is hurting. So I can still pull it with two fingers. I can even still pull it with one finger because these are the one finger levers here and they're adjustable levers as well. So, man, that's what I wanted to show you. If you're interested in that plate, make sure you hit Eric up at Trask Performance and get that plate. Like I said, coming blue, green, red, gold, and silver. Hey, man, y'all check it out, man. I just want to come to you with this. Your boy finna go ride and enjoy this day and probably come back to you a little bit later and just uh, while I'm riding and see how this clutch really feel when I'm really getting on it. So I get up with y'all on the highway. All right. Peace. What up, what up, y'all? Hey, man, I'm back with you. I just wanted to take a ride today, man. Tomorrow it's supposed to be raining, like 85%. Man, I figure I get off work on, the, on this beautiful Friday and go get me a nice little ride in because probably won't be raining. I mean, riding at all tomorrow, man, at all. Because I think by midnight, I mean three o'clock in the morning, it's gonna be raining like crazy. So Saturday gonna be one of those days where I'll probably be sitting in the house doing nothing and probably need to get some rest man because the way i drive my truck man and doing 12 14 hours a day man hey sometimes you need to rest but hey i just want to come and talk to you all about what i was just talking about in the garage about the trash power plate y'all hey man i noticed i just started noticing little things about my clutch yes it got a little bit stiffer but that's cause it's pushing all your clutch tighter and everything. Oh man, it was grass right there, woo. So with that, putting that more pressure on the plates, hey, I'm cool with it. As long as I'm not getting any slippage cause it felt like I was getting some slippage. But since I've been riding, since I put that on, I hadn't felt anything like that. But I'm gonna tell you, that is a, 
uh, go. I don't care how stiff my clutch get. But it's not that bad though, because I got the hydraulic clutch. You know, this is my 2018 uh, Road Glide. So, it's not, it's not that bad. That's an older lady getting it, man. Somebody got a bike right here for sale. Whoa, that's nice. I like a V-Ride right there. Oh, wow, that was nice. I wouldn't mind having that. But, yeah, that is, this this thing is a must, a go for you guys that making that big horsepower. Um, like I said, it's easy to put on, man. Like I said, I talked with Eric and Trask, and, uh, and I plan on doing some more stuff to the bike for a, a little bit more horsepower. And, uh, yeah, a little bit more, y'all. <laughs> I know y'all like, man, this dude crazy, but no, nah, man, you know how you can get used to something so fast and 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 it, it don't bother you anymore. So, yeah, when I first got the 128 kit on here, stage four, yeah, I, I, was, I was a little intimidated, but now, hey, man, it don't even matter. You, Man, it don't even matter to me, man. You look how cloudy it is right now, um, but I hope I don't get caught in any rain, but I do have my rain suit on. Cause you know your boy rocking this Jordans. <laughs> so yeah, I got my rain and I got those little Harley Davidson rain uh uh shoe boots, whatever you want to call them. So I did. I wore them one time before with my Jordans, and y'all, my Jordans didn't get wet at all. So yeah, but I wanted to come on here and tell y'all about that plate, y'all. So if you're looking to uh get more power, big power on your bike. I would say, go ahead and do it. I like that blue truck. Woo wee! Yeah, buddy. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to open up just a little bit, man. But I'm telling you, with this progressive lowering kit on your bike, dude, you have no issues leaning your bike. But I got, like I said, this boy lean like I got a 19 on it, man. And I love that. I love that about this bike. I know everybody upgrading to the new bike, but I'm going to wait a little while before I upgrade. I even got a phone call. Look how I'm leaning this bike, baby. I even got a phone call. Somebody asking to buy my bike. And one guy commented in the comment section on one of my videos, latest videos, asked me, hey, man. You think about selling corn? I know you've been looking at the 2024s, but man, I'm not, I'm not thinking about selling nothing. But like I said, I tell everybody I'm gonna upgrade to the garage, man. I'm gonna upgrade. I'm not, I'm not gonna uh, take away from a great bike. This is actually a new bike for me. With this new motor on here, it's like a new heart. You know what I'm saying? You got a heart transplant. So yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not, I'm not doing it, man. I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it, baby. I think I'd be sick if I did, man. I think I'd be sick if I sold this bike. Just think all of the stuff. Y'all been, for those that's been following me, all the stuff that I have put on this bike, a lot of it was out of my pocket when I first started. But then I started being blessed by different sponsors coming in and, and helping me out. And I really, I'm really grateful. Y'all, I like riding this road, but man, but when these cars get on here, Ah oh, man, it, it, it throws it off. It's a nice curvy road. But y'all, I'm, I'm riding today. I'm riding. <laughs> and I'm gonna tell y'all, the chrome works two in the one. Hey man, you can't go wrong with this chrome works two in the one. I'm telling you, you cannot do it at all, man. Yeah, you cannot do, do it. Chrome works. Like my uh, boy Williams say, Chrome works or nothing. <laughs> but yeah, Chrome works, yeah, they, they, they have great sounding exhaust, great looking exhaust, got a warranty on the exhaust if it starts to fade or whatever else. Yeah, man, Chrome works is the way to go. But uh, man, I had a tall chance to talk with Sharon and Tall today, man. I had a chance to talk with John Psycho Fanatics, man. I had, I had a chance to talk with just GQ today. Man, just had great conversation with those guys today. Um, yeah, I, a great conversation, man. It, and it was, it was, it's just great to hear people voice, and you know they're doing well, they're doing good. And I know my dude John is getting ready for this long, long trip coming up. I think he said July. They got this. Him and Holy Shift got this 
1100 miles <laughs> that they 11,000 11, miles I think that's what it is 11,000 miles they gonna do they got a long trip man and they gonna start off going up toward Milwaukee that's gonna be a nice trip he asked me without coming my I'm not sold on it yet I'm not sure if I'm going to Milwaukee this year I have been asked a couple of times but man I'm gonna tell you like this man John had this conversation today man hey dude Everybody know when they have an event. All these hotels know when they're having events going on. If you're not going with a crowd and you're getting the Airbnb, that's what I like. And you're not paying $300 a, and $400 a night. I, I can't do it. My money don't roll like that, y'all. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry. It don't roll like that. But I am going to upgrade on a new bike. I don't even know if I'm going to even get the new bike, dude. I, I, I take a 2022 CVO or, 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 or 23 CVO. It don't have to be brand new to me. Even with the 23 CVO, I still got all the new upgrades. You know what I'm saying? It don't have to be the ST. Yeah, I would love to. But man, like I said, dude, if you go into a lot of these events, make sure, hey, hey, hook up with somebody who's going and make it lighter and better where you can enjoy yourself because i'm not going nowhere down the road and spend my bill money i just i'm not doing it i'm not doing it but yeah i am definitely not doing it but y'all y'all see this nice curvy road but it's cloudy as heck though but i'm gonna tell you like this though this i love the way my clutch feel though it's engaging a lot quicker so i'm a preloader man so with that being a preloader and your clutch response is a whole lot better for you hey man you cannot go wrong i'm telling you you can't go wrong yeah this is my road right here man i'm about to pass them up y'all i'm not gonna even lie oh this guy finna turn here that I'm putting on the bike as well. I'm going to redo the rotor on the rear. Yep. I'm going to redo that. I'm going to put a gaffer rotor on the rear. I still got the stock rotor on here. I'm going to change the uh, the rear brake lever on the, you know, the flip on down here. I'm going to change that. It's going to match my uh, shifter over here. And um, it's just going to be contrast cut. It's, gonna, it's coming from Harley Davidson. They got it for me right now up there, Black Gold. I'm gonna pick that up tomorrow. Um, what else? And I'm going with a bigger breather. I'm going with a bigger breather, y'all. I'm gonna either go with Trash or I'm gonna go with uh, T-Man Performance. I already been in touch with T-Man Performance. Oh my God, y'all. Oh Jesus, I came up off my seat. That was a big old deal. Good Lord. <laughs> I don't wanna mess my wheel up, man. They need to come fix that. That wasn't there the last time I was back here. But yeah, I had to come and get a little wind therapy, man. I, man, I might even run up to Bucky's. I, I just had to come and get out a little bit. You know how it is, man. Y'all motorcycle riders. Y'all know how it is. You got to get out just a little bit. You know, you done had a long day. This is coming, just release some of that stress and, and pressure off of you and just enjoy the ride, man. And then if I go to Milwaukee, man, who in this area, Dallas, Fort Worth, you know, it ain't gotta be Dallas, Fort Worth, it can be Tyler, Houston, who's going to the Harley Davidson, uh, I don't wanna say 120, I was gonna say that again, but their anniversary. Let me know in the comment who's going back up to Milwaukee this year. Y'all, it's a long ride. It's a lot of people don't like to ride with me, man, because they're like, dude, you don't stop, man. We want to stop. But I, y'all, you know, me and, me and John had this conversation today, man. I, <laughs> uh, he said, man, y'all truck drivers are built different, man. And we, we really are. Yeah, I'm telling you, 
Kong is a runner, man. He's definitely a runner. I'm loving it. Yeah, but us truck drivers, man, we, we feel totally different from a lot of folks, man. We can we can make these long drives and these long rides and sit on our tailbone for a minute, man, because they they know if you got to get a load there on time, man, you're going to keep that, you're going to keep the right and left door closed, baby. You're going to keep them boys closed because you got to get there. But I'm telling you, man, that's just how we built. That's just how we are. I think I'm going to go this way this time. Last time I went that way, but I'm going this way, y'all. I'm, 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 I'm riding a little bit today. But yeah, us truck drivers, we are built a little bit different, a whole lot different. I'm not going to even lie to you. When you get your two in the one, when you you get the two in the one, all uh, right, uh, hey, make sure, make sure you get the reducer. I got the reducer in this boy, and um, I'm gonna let this, I'm gonna let this out the bag too. I'm pretty sure Tall cool with it, but he has a couple of exhausts that he's selling. Uh, he has a two in the one that's chrome. He has a two in the two. I'm gonna say you might have to hit him up in his box or, or Instagram or check out his video, see if his email address down there. And um, email him. I'm pretty sure he'll get back with you ASAP. John Saga Fanatics has a two in the two that he's selling as well. So man, if you're looking for his exhaust, man, Tall actually looked on, he actually looked on the internet and seen that a lot of people were sold out of these Chrome Works, man. I'm telling you, Chrome Works are selling like crazy, man. Man, I'm loving it back here, dude. I'm loving it. Woo! Cone barking at me, dog. I just, I just wanted to come out here and get a good ride in today and really test out the new power uh, plate from uh, Trash. And y'all, like I say, the clutch is just a little bit stiffer. But hey, I love it because it's engaging a little bit quicker. And that would definitely help you on your preload. It will help you. I don't know where this road go right here. I would love to know. But I guess I'll keep straight. Oh, no, nah, I know where that road go. I think I'm going to make a new time. some pretty nice road we don't have no hills and mountains in this area where i live at but there's some pretty nice roads out here man look at that look at this like i said it's cloudy but it's still beautiful man yeah all this land out here it's a lot of land Nice. Like I say, I'm gonna just get lost back here a little bit. I got GPS, I can get to the house, baby. I hope everybody having an awesome, awesome day. Woo, look at this car, baby. Woo, wee. <laughs> oh. Woo, wee. I was going a little bit too fast. I see this at 30. <laughs> hey, man, but I know how to control this bike. Hey, y'all, you never use that front brake when you're in them curves like that. Don't even think about grabbing it. And I use my... I use my rear brake probably 90% of the time. I, no, I take that back probably 99% of the time. I use my rear brake, y'all. I sure do. <laughs> I am loving it. 
loving this ride today. The car's trying to get out in front of me. Hey, that's one thing when you ride by yourself and you travel by yourself. Man, you ride your ride, baby. You ride your ride. I know I do. I ride my ride when I'm by myself. I do. I ain't gonna even lie. When I was going to Milwaukee last year, y'all. <laughs> oh, man. I was getting it. I ain't gonna even lie, y'all. Off of two hours of sleep, 16 and a half hours, I went all the way to Milwaukee, y'all. I know a lot of people are like, man, is you crazy? You know what, man? It is what it is. It is what it is. Oh man, like I say, I'm a, I like to ride like that, you know. Not knocking nobody else the way they ride. They ride, oh, Farmersville. I think I go back this way. This will take me back to my house right here. Oh man, I know where I'm at, dude. I know where I'm at. Hey, hey, I'm, hey that's what I'm talking about. Well, when I say this bike sound good, y'all, I have put some work in here. Yeah. country y'all I'm from the country I love it I love it I am not gonna even lie to you I love it Ooh, gotta watch this dirt and gravel right here Looks like they trying to get it out the road that's what they doing too oh it's a lot of it your boy is not trying to go down like they building some over there and they and these uh, end dumps dropping dirt and rock everywhere look at he's even way down here getting it out the road man Woo, man i'm telling y'all when you ride dude y'all look out for gravels and rock man look it look out for it because it's it be on the road believe it or not it be loose gravel and rocks out here on the road Yeah, I'm just letting the camera run, y'all. I'm just letting that boy run. Farmersville, we going this way. 78, let's get it. Y'all, we got some decent back roads back here, I'm telling you. We got some, but we got some for you. We got some, it's a barbecue place up here in Farmersville, y'all, that my boy Chris turned me on to. Yeah, my boy Chris turned me on to it and uh, man, it's some good food. Wow. Y'all, my bike rides so, not bragging on my bike or nothing like that, but my bike rides so smooth. It's, I mean, really, really smooth, man. I love it. Look at it. It's, woo! God's green earth out here, baby. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I ain't gonna hold y'all long out here, man. We gonna stop this ride right up in here I just want to come on here and talk to you all for a little while and man I'm looking forward to my next trip that I know I got is Knoxville but no I take that back what's that May 16th through the 18th uh, Black Wall Street Tulsa local home I might be going down to uh, Austin this weekend. My wife and them having their AKA um they big comforts down there. Her you know her and her sister are AKAs. So um uh, 
they going down there and I told them I might ride down there on my bike. Uh, I got some subscribers down there and um, I might ride down that way. Woo -hoo -hoo, I'm loving this man. I got some subscribers down there and I was just gonna uh, make an announcement if I go down there next Saturday I think they leaving out Thursday so next Saturday I'm thinking about going down there go down there Saturday morning I might go Friday night though not sure but man I'm gonna end this video right here baby I love y'all man until next time baby the next grind man y'all stay safe y'all have a blessed weekend y'all ride safe out here and be very vigilant out here, man, because people do not see us. I say it all the time. They do not see us. I done had too many cars come over on me and almost hit me. But I'm going to tell you what I did, though. My pipes, I ran my engine up, dude. And that helped me, man. That saved me. So, man, till next time, the next grind, y'all stay safe. I'm out. Peace.